Oh, back in Medellin. The beautiful Alejandra accompanying me to the restaurant. So they have this beautiful car here. It's a special deluxe. Plymouth, wow. How beautiful. So flip it. Ah, oh, it's a wonder what model it is. Really beautiful. So Plymouth. Really nice. So she was asking me what I like about the food in Colombia, and I said the, the fish, the coast, but everything is fried. They don't, uh, they don't really. It's not very healthy when it's fried with all the, all the uh, uh, oil, saturated fats. So, so I asked for the lentil soup. They just ran out. Lentil soup is so delicious here and. Uh, in Colombia, instead, I got the frijoles, which is very typical. Frijoles are the red uh, kidney beans. And Alejandra got the ajiaco. Ajiaco. And this drink is um, fresa, so it's strawberry and berries. This is all the drink soup and, um, and a plate. Protein plate with salad, small salad. Um, Rice and fries offer 17,200, so it's like, uh, I think it's like around 4,100 now, so that's like uh, five bucks, something like that. Less than that, four and a half. Back in Medellin, here in Loreles, having a Club Colombia fruits of Medellin in the Amazon jungle walking around here the city of eternal spring my buddy from Vegas Jimbo how we doing uh, Medellin my man Medellin yeah they say Medellin well, it's all a J, a J instead of the all double L is turning well, to some a J. people say Medellin too Medellin yeah I think most of the dream goes now thank God yeah hola City, man. It is. It's, in all my travels, man, as far as just a, a beautiful, comfortable city, Medellin is number one. I've been everywhere Japan, Thailand, Philippines, Panama, Costa Rica, Brazil. You name it, man. And as far as comfort, quality of life for what you get for your dollar, it's tough to beat Medellin. But with that cheap cost of life, there is, is more dangerous than a lot of places I've been to. Right. Right, and you kind of get that in Europe too. In Southern Europe, it's cheaper. I mean, more expensive than here, of course, but you get that safety that uh, you don't get here, you know? That's the only wild card here, safety and... Uh, yeah, as and I told you before, you know, it, Medellin is great until it's not. So you have one of those bad moments where you, you won't want to leave your, your, the covers of your bed. Yeah, it, that can't happen here, man. But if you're not dumb, you're not flashy. Usually, you're left alone. Yeah, and even if if we aren't flashy, it still can we, happen. And we are dumb. We are a target. You're always a target. Yeah. They but, see us and they see money. They see dollar signs. Yeah. I mean, just holding this this GoPro in my hand, you know, three hundred and fifty three hundred fifty dollars. You know, it's just I'm a target. If you know Spanish, though, man, like, I don't know if I would leave here. Yeah. yeah. I mean, if I was fluent in Spanish, I'm an older guy, so. If I was well, fluent, though, man, it's. I learned it uh, practicing it in Mexico the last two years of pandemic and, and now the last year in Colombia, so. Oh, you I just mean, recently learned Spanish? Well, I, I always had a Latin base because Portuguese is my first language when I was a baby. That's impressive. But, uh, but yeah, I learned it, and there's so many. Latins in uh, New Jersey where I grew up, so I, I always heard it. By the way, Davi Vienda, they don't charge you ATM fees, and you get two million. Really? Two million in one shot. 
I did not know that. Yeah, La Vivienda. Um, this is your this is your your bank. Yeah, I um, you know Charles Schwab reimburses all that. Though. Yeah, yeah, but you can get two million here, and both Colombia only give you a hundred thousand. Yeah, um, the other one, uh, it's blue. They used to be free blue. Too. It was blue. I can't think of the name of it. Mm -hmm. They used to be free, and now they charge you money. Oh, let me. So we're here in the famous Calle La Setenta. Yeah, it's second most famous street in Medellin. Second most famous street, right? So we're gonna go to Exito, which is like a, a small Walmart. Get us a couple of uh, drinks there. Huh? Yeah, they're called Litz. Litz? Yeah. And uh, you can see gasoline is uh, 14,000, so the peso is a 4,000, so uh, it's like $3.50 a liter. <laughs> In the engines, yeah, and the gasoline. So it just popped open its bad boy, Oktoberfest, Blue Columbia. Check it out, see what it tastes like. Yeah, it's like, uh, it's got a little taste of stout. Oh, such a beautiful dog. It's got a little bitter taste of stout, you know, well, like, you uh, I want, I told you to it looks like it's, it tastes, I'll get that next. It tastes like, um, a Sam Adams. It tastes a little bit like a Sam Adams. What'd you get? Baru. You got a Baru. Baru. Oh yeah, that's the islands. That's the beaches, Baru. So that's the, like the latest, uh, drink. That's sugar free. But usually like, you here just cruise up and down. Yeah, one round. Actually, when I first moved here, I lived on the street. Right, and if I like something, oh, the music must have been intense at 6 a.m. Yeah, they put me in a special room. <laughs> they had a fantastic hotel gym. It was cheap back then, now it's not. It was only like 15 bucks a night. Man. How hot are the Colombian women? They're so hot that sometimes you get caught checking out a 60 year old. Yeah. <laughs> Even the older ladies, they take care of themselves. They don't never stop. They do. It's so true. I go I go to Lorela's mall and every now and then she might be 65 or 67 and I'm checking her out. Yeah. And I'm like, she was probably like an 11 I'm when, telling you, man. when she was like 30 years old. You'd be so proud of your woman if she aged like the women here do. They age better here than any other place in the world. Right. Right. Some people say they give up. You know, like it's shallow, but it's not. They they take care of themselves. They care about how they look. There's nothing wrong with that. Yeah, I, I don't even think they're like that cult like about it. It's just that, that was the it's thing just, I was telling you about BBVA. Earlier. Right. It's Blue just Bay. their lifestyle and it's just the heredity, you know? Every it's, third store here is a fingernail store. You know? <laughs> A uh, hair store, you know, a salon, spa. So, what happened with the priest that was uh, drugged at La Chismosta across the street? Uh, he did, he uh, was a known priest in this local area. He was watching a football game and uh, had like two two drinks, and a guy basically robbed him in the back. It was it was midday, and uh, no one was really around. No one was like watching him constantly. And he passed out, and the bar owner thought he just passed out from drinking too much. He didn't know how much he was served. So they drug his ass outside on the street and left him there, but he wasn't moving. And then finally someone called the cops, and they found out he was dead. Right. So someone drugged right. his drink and took his money. Yeah. Right. In the back. It was a slow night. Right. It was a football game. And what did he have? Did, did they know what just he had? Couple, just a couple of drinks. No, what did he have as far as what he lost? Oh, I don't know what he had on him, his cell phone, his pocket money. Right. So that's how crazy, right, it is here? A priest. Yeah. This is why when I go out, 
I don't go out alone. This is why I go out with Jimbo here. Yeah. He knows karate. Yeah. <laughs> so I'll usually just like sit here or I'll sit over there. Even though it gets loud, you can't have a conversation. And just chill and watch my drink, you know? So we headed to uh, Poblado instead, but uh, we could turn here. And, yeah, uh, and instead, uh, the traffic was so crazy. We, we ended up getting an Uber. Yeah, it was terrible. At 6.30. And it was like 30 minutes just to go breathing those fumes. Just to yeah, go a few was, miles. Yeah, so. I probably got cancer. <laughs> so we ended up coming to La Setenta. Checking out La Setenta. See, this is where I usually order all like, all my drinks. With the liquor. There's never going traffic here, though. There's never going traffic. No, and we, we can walk home. Yeah. And look, it didn't rain. Julieta. I got a couple of places marked on my Google Maps of where to go here, but it's still so early. It's like, you know. So I was here for Christmas, and right on this corner, they, they had a barbecue on a the sidewalk. They had coals on the sidewalk. I'll show you the video. Right here, right on the sidewalk. <laughs> This smells really good. Yeah, yeah this is beef. Huh? Huele rico. Claro, bueno. Está bueno. Acá la orden para acá, yo siempre la doy. Bueno, está bueno. Yeah, carne, man. I like a big chicharrón too, man. Like if you see any of that big giant, cheap, big piece of bacon. Like um, the place across the street where I go to eat, they have it. They have it as a plate. Just the damn. No, they have that, they, they, you get a salad, you get rice, you get a soup, 17,000 and a drink. <laughs> Big, thick, but it's fried, right? Deep fried. Uh, I don't know if it's deep fried, I think it's deep fried. Yeah. Uh, there's a girl outside with a dog and I... A I, gigantic dog. Okay. I started, yeah, I started chatting with her, of course, because Jimbo needs a date. And uh, she's all over him. She's all over him, the dog too. So... She's outside, she couldn't enter because she's got a dog. So the debate is, um, she's here with somebody else that's inside. Yeah. Is that someone, a female, a mother, a sister, a friend, a girlfriend, or is it a dude? I'm going with a uh, female. Okay, I I'm thinking maybe female too. She's saying because it's a female. Oh, you're right, there's the mom. <laughs> so, she's probably saying go home. Uh, or maybe she's chatting with her the same way we were chatting about the dog. We'll see. It is a bit, it is a bit. So now I'm going to have the red. So Jimbo claims that the red is the best in it, Colombia, is the best one. The beer. Oh, really? Okay. So I usually, I usually have the, the regular, the dorada. I had the blue, which is Oktoberfest today. And then today I'm having the red with Colombia. Te gusta esa? Sí, esa está bien. Es mi primera vez tomar la hoja. Porque la, la, la azul es Oktoberfest. Y normalmente la dorada o la regular. Ah, okay. Pero me gusta mucho. ¿Te puedo filmar? Sí, tranquilo, no importa. Uh, Aria, ¿estás en filme? <laughs> ¿Su mamá? Sí, ella es mi mamá. Ah, ok. Placer. Yeah. Aria, ¿no quieres ir? ¿Te quedas? Te quedas. <laughs> grab her number. You didn't grab her number. Just walk this way. Oh, I'm gonna show you the empanada place that I like. There's a really good empanadas here. So I don't usually eat fried food, and the empanadas they make here are very hard fried. That that guy was like, I bought with me. He's probably yeah. selling. I saw. Uh, and he I was. Saw, he either saw. wanted to. Oh fuck, yeah. dude! I grew up in Newark, New Jersey. I know shit. Okay. Yeah. But anyway, he was either he want, either wanted to take me down, rob the camera, or sell me. Yeah. Yeah, I so I usually have like the chicken, and uh, I have like two, and I'm full for the for the night. I don't eat a lot it's of night. It's a huge, I, it's corn, cool, so it's a huge insulin response. Yeah, yeah, totally. And I don't eat fried, so all the mono saturated. Ah, qué lindo perro! He was just here like two weeks ago. Oh. Everyone was telling him not to go down there because he had nothing but shorts on. Right. If you're yeah. like, 
You wear shorts in Colombia, Medellin. You're that a is. target. You're a fucking target. You're a tourist. You don't know what you're doing. You're new. You're gonna get robbed. I'm here. I'm Montenero. El Montenero. Montañero. 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 me el español. The best service in Colombia, right here. Jimbo. 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 Hey, it's Tony. Uh, please help me grow my channel. I ask you to subscribe. Press on the subscribe button. A thumbs up is the like. And then uh, the bell. The bell gives you a notification when I've uploaded a new video so you can watch uh, new content. And then comment. Um, let me know what you like and dislike. Thank you so much for watching. Aloha.